Praise Radio, and we're here at the third annual Turkey Classic, and we have Miss Regina here, the owner and creator of Jenna Key. Jenna Key, did I say it right? Jenna Key <laughs> Event Coordinating and Management. Any type of event that you need coordinated and managed, uh, Regina will help you with that. She's not going to talk, but she's going to help you with it, but she's going to talk a little bit today. Regina, tell us a little bit about your business and you. I've been doing events for eight years. I started out modeling. I had my own dance group for four years. And I kind of like doing stuff behind the scenes. I like setting up. I like to see people's reaction to, you know, the atmosphere and the decor. And so that's kind of why I stuck with the event planning. Because you just like, you go in, you make it pretty, and you walk out. Pretty much. <laughs> That's the good part about it. That's the, so when you when people come in and they see what what kind of um, services do you offer? Um, I'm actually doing like for instance the balloon setup. I do table setups. We do the event decor coordination, um, full fledged events, and I also have some equipment for rental. Well, we would love to have you on 108 Praise Radio. You can come by the studio anytime you like. Feel free to advertise with us as well. Um, and we're here if you need us. I'll do the talking since you're not comfortable with that, okay? You just tell me what you want to say and I'll say it for you. But we want to get your business out there. We want to promote um, Jenna Key and just let the world know that Jenna Key it, it, it exists. More people need to know about you is how I feel about it. Even though you may have a great clientele right now, it can always be more, right? Yes. Exactly. So we do thank you for talking with me today. I thank you for stepping outside your comfort zone. You make that one step. I really do appreciate it because it can be hard. I, I know that. I'm a talker by nature, so yeah, I'm, I'm like this in the camera. <laughs> so, <laughs> but we do appreciate you. We thank you, and we hope that you tune in to 108PraiseRadio.com, okay? Thank you, Regina. Okay, and this is 108PraiseRadio.com, and I am Halavisha with Women 101 on PraiseRadio.com, empowering women one word at a time, and I am here with... Sabrina Kirkland. Sabrina Kirkland. Sabrina, tell us a little bit about yourself and what it is. I see this beautiful table called My Name Is Me. But you said my name is me is the business. So just tell us, introduce us to what you do. Yes, my name is Sabrina Kirkland, and I am from uh, Miami, Florida. Originally, by from Florida, by way of um, going through Orlando. Worked with the police department, Orlando Police Department, for 13 years, where I worked with children of abuse. And um, in doing so, I moved here to Atlanta and realized that there is a need because I work with victims of human trafficking, and Atlanta is our hub. Um, they trade the girls out and take them back down the coast. So here, I thought I was going to come here and, hey, start this over. And then the Lord said, nope, I need you to be, give our children a voice. They don't have a voice. And with molestation, it's the elephant in the room, so to speak. So it's now time for us to shine that light on it. Um, the name of the company is My Name Is Me. My Name Is Me as an individual. My Name Is Me as an individual with rights. My Name Is Me is that person that the Constitution was set for. I have rights as an individual, and you are not able to violate my rights, violate my person, and make me feel ashamed about it. I have a voice. Speak. And so we want to give our children an outlet for that voice, and this book is called My Private Space, and it's basically saying that my private space is not our secret. If someone touches you inappropriately, talk about it. Tell. Do not keep it a secret. And so um, parents, a lot of times, they don't know how to have the conversation with their children. And when they do, they're like, if anyone touches you, you know what's going to happen to them. So now the child is going, well, no, we better not say anything, because if I do, then mom's going to get hurt or dad's going to get hurt. So they keep the secret. Well, I don't want them to do that. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm excited about this. I'm glad to see this. This is a way to, to speak into our kids and give our kids a voice. Just tell us right quick, like, how can we get in contact with you? How can we get the books? How can we contact you? Oh, um, it's available online on www.myprivatespacebook.com or Sabrina Y. Kirkland.com. I'm also on Facebook, My Private Space Book, and also Sabrina Rietti, that's R I E T T I E Kirkland on Facebook. Well, thank you for, to, for chatting with us today. We want to get you to tune in to 108PraiseRadio.com, and we'd love to have you on any of our shows, um, and I'd love to have you personally on mine one Saturday morning. Come out to um, Empower Women, one word at a time, okay? Thank you. All right, so we're here at 108PraiseRadio.com, and we're here at the third annual Turkey Classic.
And I have Jordan with me, who is the winner of the Slam Dunk Contest. Jordan, Jordan, Jordan. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, I'm 22. I'm from Marietta, Georgia. I've been dunking professionally for about two years now. So, like, I really just travel all around the world uh, spreading the message that nothing was handed to all the kids that you can do whatever you put your mind to. I didn't play basketball in high school, so everything I got in basketball I had to really just go and work hard to prove to people that I could do something with basketball professionally. So, wh where do you play basketball, or where did you play basketball? Uh, I played in college at Chattahoochee Tech, and then shortly after, when my mom got diagnosed with breast cancer, I looked into being a professional dunker because I found out it was a good way to make money doing something I was passionate about. Jordan, you you just dunked over how many kids? Four kids. Four. Four. You jumped up. That's that's a light dunk. I do that all the time. They, uh, when they called me to do this dunk contest, I really wanted to put on the show. My first couple of dunks were as good, so I had to know I had to finish it off good for the people. I mean, Jordan, I, you taking Jordan to a whole another level. You bump the old Jordan. We got this Jordan <laughs> on lock. Um, but thank you for chatting with us today. We are 108 Praise Radio.com. You can tune in. I'm very proud of you. Continue to do what you're doing and continue to reach the youth like you're doing. And like you, how's your mom? She's good. She's in the crowd. God is good. My mom was diagnosed with breast cancer and went through the whole nine, and she's still here too. So it's a blessing just to have them. It's a great time of the year to be thankful, right? So thank you for chatting with us, Jordan. How can we contact you? Uh, you can follow me on Instagram at flight.nwh. Flight.nwh. I follow most people back. I got training tips, all the videos. If you need to just inspiration, need somebody to talk to, I'm there too. Thank you, Jordan. Thank you so much. All right. This is Halavisha with Women 101 on 108 Praise Radio.com. And we're here live at the third annual Turkey Classic. And we have Limits Dre here who just killed the national anthem. If you guys missed it, you missed the treat. Dre, tell us a little bit about yourself. Well, I'm 22 years old. I'm from College Park, Georgia. And I'm a college student at Georgia State. I'm so proud of you. You keep doing that. Rocking on, black girl. Black girl rock. So, exactly. So, how long have you been singing? How can we get in contact with you? I've been singing all my life. I do musical theater and I sing. I record. Um, you can get in touch with me on Instagram, Twitter, at Dre Jack Music. And who's that again? Dre Jack Music. I J A C K M U S I C. I'm going to follow you. Yes, I am. And I'm going to get you out. We're going to get you out in the studio because I know you're thankful. Your voice tells it all. You have too much soul. And I'm there. Tell us again. I go to Impact Church on Sylvan Road. I come, I sing there too, so. You better plug that church in. Won't he do it? <laughs> Well, girl, we're so excited to see you. We're so excited to be here with you. I'm so proud of you. You nailed that uh, national anthem. Just a great. This is just a great scene all together, right? Just to be able to give back, and we and you just gave back with your voice, thank you. with your talent. Thank you so much. So thank you, and thank you for being here. Tune in 108PraiseRadio.com, and we're at, we'll we'll just chat with you later. I'm gonna keep in touch with you. I'm gonna follow you. Okay. Thank you. All right. This is Halavisha Hall at 108PraiseRadio.com, and we are live at the third annual Turkey Classic here in Decatur, Georgia. And right here with us, we have Commissioner Larry Johnson, who is the commissioner of District 3 and one of the main reasons this event is going on. Commissioner, can you tell us a little bit about this event and why you're here? And well, the event is about giving back and making a difference in our community. And so we wanted to give back over 300 turkeys. Uh, we got other resources that we're doing here. So it's all about collaboration and building partnerships so we can move forward under a sports venue. So I'm excited for everybody to be at our intergenerational center, $8 million facility, and a design to make things like this happen. You know, that's something good, and it gives back. Giving back is always a great feeling anyways. You told me you've been giving all day. What have you been doing all day? Well, it's been a big day. I mean, we do, it's our fifth year, we do a turkey giveaway, and so we did 600 turkeys this morning, and I adopted uh, 400 kids for Christmas. I've been doing that for about 18 years, so we got about 9,000 kids that we get gifts to for the holiday season, and so they bring the gift back by December 7th. We have a big performance at the mall. And this is the last part of the project. And then on Monday, we're doing 200 food baskets with turkeys for families who may need them. Isn't so that's how it's about. 
That is a blessing. It's always a blessing to be a blessing. Tell me about this event, the 2016 Holiday Village. Well, I wanted to start something for the community to bring us together more. And so we bring out all of the choirs from the senior centers, our middle schools, and we have Christmas carols, and we have folk just perform in our community. And we just have a good time, and then they light the trees. And then we have organizations uh, do a tree, and then we donate the tree to a needy family. Yes. Well, we really do thank you for stopping and chatting with us. Commissioner, I think you're doing a great job well, here. God Congratulations. Is he God is all, makes it all happen. All the time. God, you can't do nothing, so I, I give him all the glory. Exactly. And we do the same over at 108praiseradio.com. Yeah, yeah. We're happy to have you to be a part of our family. You're a part of our family well, now. I'm ready. So, I'm ready. Uh, Let's go. <laughs> He said, let's roll. Well, we'll, be, we'll have you tuning in. We want you tuning in to 108praiseradio.com. We're going to be giving you your special shout-outs right. because you're just a blessing just to be in the community and to be able to do something of this magnitude. We really Thank do appreciate it. Yes, sir. We really do appreciate it. Ooh, 108praiseradio.com, and we are here at the third annual Turkey Classic, and we have Char Bates of the Char Bates Show. Look, Char. What's I'm loving this. Tell us about yourself. Thank you so much for having me. Uh, like she said, I go by the name Char Bates. I'm the Red Carpet Slayer. Um, I just love to give back to the community and help entrepreneurs and entertainers get where they're going. So whether it's from interviews to business consultations to community events and mentoring, um, I have a gift and I love to give back. And I like to make people happy. People don't like nine to fives. At all. So make us happy. Those, hit me up. <laughs> but tell us how to get in contact with you. Hey, I, I am Char Bates everywhere. I am Char Bates with an S, not a C, um, from Facebook to Instagram. Check out my website, charbates.com. And if you want to get in contact with me, if you want to grow your business or just find out how you can be more involved in the community, um, you can contact me at IamSharBates at gmail.com. Once again, everything is I am Char Bates <laughs> with an S, not a C. Thank you guys so much for having me, man. We live on 108 Praise Radio. 108PraiseRadio.com with Char Bates. Boom. Well, this is Halavisha at 108PraiseRadio.com, host of Women 101 on Saturday mornings. And I'm here with Jarrell. How you doing? Hi, Jarrell. Tell us about this. Oh, Jarrell is also the creator of this event. Aren't you? You're fully behind this event, 100%, which is a nice event. Tell us about it and how you got started. Okay, so it's our third year annual Turkey Classic. We actually have a dunk contest, basketball game, dance team, and we actually play in the Cab Police Department, so we're bridging the gap in the community all in one. Plus, we're actually giving away turkeys and all the size. All at the same time. I want y'all to stomp that police department now. Let them know. Y'all, I mean, what is it? What? You want to say that 4124? Well, uh, stop the police department. I mean, I like the police. Daddy, uh, you know, my dad was a police. So, Dad, I love the police, but stop the police department. So, we team Spartans, That's right? All, team, day. All, day. All, day. Team all day. All day. All day. So, how do we contact you? How do we follow you? How do we keep in touch okay. with you to know about other events? All social media is Georgia Spartans. The website is www.georgiaspartans.net, and that's Georgia spelled out. Okay. What is Georgia Spartans? I'm um, basically just a semi pro men's basketball team. We play January through June at the YMCA on campus. To roll. Okay. All right. Well, thank you, and thank you for chatting with us here at 108praiseradio.com. We'll be glad to get you in the studio. All right. Thank you. Base. Yeah.